Folks, we got the one and only Salim in the house. So yeah, I'm uh, happy to help. I'm trying to protect these Telegram groups because they are being attacked like by, by the bots, impersonators. They're trying to fuck, uh, fuck shit up. And yeah, I'm trying to protect these groups um, as much as we can because this is what we have. This is like the new TV. This it's is. like the YouTube, the Telegram groups. So yeah. we need to protect what we have. And it's so valuable. It, it able me to connect with so much people, create so many things. I would have never thought. I still have my gamer headset. Like I'm trying. I'm I'm, I'm I'm trying to get a new microphone because I'm still using my gamer headset that I bought ten years ago because I didn't expect I'll be in this fight. Like uh, like doing this kind of interviews, talking about superpowers disclosure. I entered the fight because I saw the censorship that was hardcore before that. I was mostly posting like uh, variety videos, gaming videos, a little bit inspirational. We love Victoria, absolutely. And yeah, we all. Connected, I felt very early on that uh, XRP was going to be important. Like uh, I heard some intel uh, about uh, this this um, this crypto, like uh, that it would be important in the future. But I didn't realize how much important it was, like uh, and how it was connecting to to the galactic side. Because I'm more interested in the galactic things, like the the metaphysical things. I'm like I, I start to activate my superpowers. This, is, this shit is real. <laughs> this shit is real. Remote viewing, like uh, remote healing. I've been doing some crazy shit. Like I get uh, knowledge done. I hear, oh, well, I saw you coming before you came talk to me, man. I saw you one day before in my vision. I had a vision of you one day before you show, showed up in my gym. That's like, a scary what? thought, bro. I Sometimes I hear you in my head when, I, when, you check my, when you check my blog, I know it, man. I feel it. I feel the reactions. The, the, this is great. Like for me, I, I feel like I'm going to start levitating like any day now. Start levitating, teleporting because I'm already doing it like so fast and so, so clearly in my visions, like, uh, I'm like, it's, I'm like, it's going to happen anytime now. So this is why like, uh, I'm, I'm really into, I'm um, interested into XRP because uh, it's an intergalactic uh, currency. But uh, I think the real value in the future is going to be the frequencies. And um, one of your guests said something amazing. Uh, happy is the new rich, uh, something else. Kindness is a new currency or something. That was great from Crypto Barney, I think. So yeah, mm -hmm. great guest. I'm learning from all of you. And I'm trying to gather all the knowledge from the best teachers in the world into one blog, the Mukas blog, so I can uplift all the Jedis, all this for free. Um, Daddy already, like Source already blessed me with, uh, with so much abundance, so much uh, bliss. I, I, I love my life so much. So now I'm just sharing everything for free. And I think... Um, it's so exciting where we're going. Like uh, we're going galactic. I see it. I, I, I already, I'm already in contact with my Arcturian brothers, like uh, some other Ichi races. Like even though it's not really physical, but I can sense them. I can feel them. I can hear them so clearly now. And uh, also Source, of course, Source is nonstop, cracking up jokes, jokes with Source, cracking up jokes with Smarty telepathically. We almost don't even need to chat on the on in the DMs. Just yeah, it's going to come to that. It's going to come to that. That's a, this is a gradual progression, okay? That people cannot wrap their minds around because they're chicken brains. You know, we're dealing with chicken brains that are damaged chicken brains. You see, I have a friend of a friend of mine who actually owns a chicken farm in Alaska. And I had a conversation with this guy like a year ago. And I, I called, I, I don't know what the conversation was, but I, I said chicken brains. He started laughing. He goes, you know, he goes, I, I got some pretty smart chickens, he says. So he goes, because he said, this might be an insult to chickens because these people, some of these people are so stupid. You know what I mean? They're so dumb, you know? So he said, he's, he's got 150,000 chickens. If you got 150,000 chickens in your coop, chances are you might recognize a smart chicken every now and then, right? He said, this might be an insult to chickens because I got a few chickens that are pretty smart. Incredible ride, brother. You know, li listen, you know, it's all about clean living. It's all about getting your pineal gland. It's, it's a, try to get to close to the light as possible. And now I got a direct contact because you guys are connected, right? So I'm right there with and you. I wanted to say, like, uh, we have to be understanding. It's true that uh, people are really stupid in this age, but uh, the poisoning and the programming is so intense. Like, uh, when I started detoxing, I understood why. Uh, I, I thought I was uh, pretty clean. And uh, and when I, the detox started and I saw all the crap come out of me, like a white, some white powder coming out for months and months, some crap came out of me from everywhere, my back, my, my arm, where I got uh, vaccinated long time ago. I had so much crap that came out right here. And uh, now that I'm detoxed, uh, I understand like uh, why these uh, abilities are coming online. Like uh, 
you also have to train your third eye. Like just imagine, imagine nonstop, imagine nonstop, and it's going to start growing. Mm -hmm. But mm -hmm. yeah, uh, you also you the, there's so many things that are limiting people, like the beliefs, the the, the toxins, the water. I I switched to to the distilled water. It's extremely important. And the distilled water with the holo charged with the holograms, it's like the shit. Like I I, I have a hard time drinking something else. So yeah, um, I, I'm I'm trying to be understanding to people. My parents also are not awake. They have no idea what I'm doing. They, they don't <laughs> they barely understand English. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So I'm trying to be understanding, but they're waking up slowly. Like uh, Smarty says, as the consciences not rise, people are going to start to sense the truth uh, much more easier. Now, I have no problem. You said you have a superpower. You can watch videos like uh, while sleeping or something. Yes. I have the same yes. thing. Like uh, I can watch a thumbnail and I know what the video is going to be about. I can know if uh, I need to watch this video or not. I can know what, which part I'm, I'm, I can skip to. So I'm researching so fucking fast and I'm putting all the best of the best of the best in the blog Mukas. Check it out, guys. And yes, I yeah. checked your website, QFS uh, something. Some of the best videos on XRP are there. I stole some for my blog. Thank you. Yeah, no, no problem. You know, I'll tell you, I'll tell you, I know you, there's no stealing here. We're, we're, we're just, everything is open source. You know what I mean? This is not about... A Salim being bigger than me or Smarty being bigger than uh, Salim. It's about the team. It's about the collaboration. You know, Love together this. we're going to win this thing because we have to. You know why? Because if I'm wrong, you're fucked. <laughs> it's really, you know what I mean? If we're wrong, you're screwed. <laughs> yes, you prefer the cabal world? Yeah. Right? You know, yeah. It's like, yeah okay yeah you got your xrp it's worth a hundred thousand dollars each yeah you got your trophy wife you got your mercedes benz you got your rolls royce phantom but people are living underneath the bridge eating out of garbage cans you want that no this is what i want I'm everybody this. to have this is why i'm sharing smarties uh, holograms because for me it's one of the best way to to fix starvation to fix uh, some of the biggest problems in the world so I've been putting them in hologram sheets and sharing them everywhere, everywhere. And it's uh, at the beginning, people are just, uh, are just wondering how this can work. But uh, when they see the result happen, you said like you feel something. Now, like I cannot, uh, I cannot go back to anything else. I used to take so much health supplements, maybe 10, 10, like, you know, spirulina, chlorella, uh, chlorophyll. I, I don't take now any of this shit anymore. Like it has saved me like a lot of money in fuel, electricity. And all this for free. So I said, I said to my audience in uh, my French audience, I told them this: these free images are worth millions. So I'm like, uh, I cannot not share. Like it would be criminal for me in Morocco, seeing all the starvation and people suffering, not to share this. And I've seen some people freeze when you talk about this, and they feel threatened because they have the same kind of business, but uh, like uh, lower. Like they freak out and they're like, oh shit, uh, they're like. Um, they, they freak out. They, they don't want to, to, to share because it's uh, competing with them. But I'm like, fuck this. I'm trying to heal the world. I'm going for full disclosure. I don't give a shit who says what. And uh, we're going to do it anyway. And like exactly. Smarty says, we're going to embarrass you. Go against us. We're going to be embarrassed. I've seen it so many times, man. People go against us, try to talk shit. I've seen people like source, like put, put their foot in their mouth. like a, And uh, it's painful to see. So I, I've seen it many times. I'm trying to save you guys the embarrassment. Um, don't mess with Source and the Jedi's because we're dangerous. Yeah, yeah, absolutely, absolutely. And, uh, so you live, in Mor you live in you live in Morocco. Gym. You live right, right close to where you're. Right, you're right. You know, you're you can throw a rock and hit Sicily. That that's how far <laughs> that's how far you and I really are, are apart. You know, I mean, like that's where I was born. I was born on the island of Sicily. Man. Um... It's so interesting to see you. you I cannot believe you're 59. One, one time you said your age, I'm like, holy yeah. shit, how can this guy be 59? And look, you're a green guy. You have no white hair and stuff. And uh, when you talk about also your parkour, like uh, trying all, all kinds of entrepreneurship, like uh, been following Grant Cardone, the same, been following uh, Gary V, Ty Lopez, the same. And uh, now we found XRP and uh, like a higher purpose. We realized that there's so much, uh, there's always something higher. And I like that you didn't stop at the at the crypto thing. Like, uh, be very easy. Like, like you know, the crypto Hulk. It's like crypto, 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 crypto. It's like getting getting boring so fast. But yeah. I like the guy. But it's getting boring really fast. You know and what it is? Really it, it's not just a crypto Hulk. I like him as a person. But they're all preaching the same song, and they 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 all know. Listen, every single one of them by now, I guarantee you, every single one of them has seen the video of me and Emily, where we prove beyond a shadow of a doubt with irrefutable, irrevocable evidence that the lawsuit was settled October 1st, 
2021, right? Why, why are they still talking the lawsuit? Because there's nothing else to talk about. If, if that cat comes out of the bag in a big way where that video should have got you know, hundreds of thousands of hit, if that, if that video, let's say in the next couple of weeks, gets a couple hundred thousand hits, and I'm going to keep leaving it here just for the hell of it. I'm going to keep leaving it right up here somewhere. This way you guys can click on it and go make up your own mind, make up your own decision. We show you the documentation. We're not hiding anything. So, you know, if that, if that cat comes out in a very big way where there's like hundreds of thousands of hits on that video, XRP Army doesn't have any content to talk about because there's nothing to talk about except let's wait for the lawsuit to be over or, or you know, not the lawsuit, but let's wait for the, for the bullshit media, whatever, because they're really at this point, they sound they're like mainstream media. They're talking about something that is not real. Yeah, man, I don't follow these guys. Honestly, I, I respect Emily because he's, she's been connecting the dots to the galactic side. But people who just loop on the same thing, just to turn on the camera and read articles. I'm right. like, the, I'm, I don't even need to, to see this. Like, come on. And yeah. um, it's so much bigger than what we thought. What I really wanted to say is uh, some mistake I see a lot of shooters do is like they don't recognize that there are there are so, so many layers to this. Like people like, oh, for example, I like Trump. They're, they're all into Trump. But above Trump, there are the, the Space Force. And then above mm. Space Force, there are the Galactics. And above the Galactics, there is Source Directive, the, the Jedis. And people mm. don't recognize this. And uh, this, this stays stu stuck at Trump. They're like, yeah, for, uh, Trump, Trump, Trump. And they don't recognize that there's so many, so much higher levels. Mm -hmm. And even mm -hmm. some people, like when they get stuck at the Galactic side, but they don't recognize that they're even higher than the Galactics. Like the right. Elohim type, Ascended Masters, Angel, this is real. This is, right. this is the top of the food chain. And yeah. I see people get stuck, like uh, they want to support Trump, and they don't realize that they're supporting like the proxy of a proxy of a proxy. And it's the same thing yeah. on the dark side. Like people like, uh, oh, the cabal. The cabal is not the top level. There is the cabal. No. And, and then there is like the, 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 the... Everybody reports to somebody. Exactly. And uh, they don't recognize the, the hierarchy. And I, I just want to save people time. Like, uh, why would you want to hang out with like the proxy of the proxy of the proxy? Why don't you go straight up to the top and get the best technology uh, you'll ever Exactly. Have? I'm like, I'm, I'm very fast kind of guy. Like, I'm like, I want to fast, I want to fast, I want to do it fast. Like Ty Lopez, who wants to be millionaire at 70? Like, I want to be billionaire now. Done. Yeah. See? Well, you know, so we're getting back to this lawsuit, Salim, with all due respect. They're going to yeah, make okay. the announcement that the lawsuit was settled on the date that they're going to say, and they're going to wipe off the egg off the face of the SEC and the government, because right now they look ridiculous, right? So they got to they gotta spin it so that it doesn't look so ridiculous for them. But they're on their way out. Everybody's on their way out. I mean, nobody's around, you know? Mel, you, know you know, you know the whole story. Mel, we already, how the, we already know how the story is going. We're going to the stars. XRP is the cryptocurrency of the stars. Like lawsuit or no lawsuit, I'm not even paying attention to this. I know that XRP is going to be the one, like you said, and uh, there are also the other ones that are going to be important. So yeah, um, this is just a show. Smarty have been telling us a long time ago, this is just to show like uh, to give people time to wake up, to give people uh, time for the people who are uh, really connected to source to, to get into, uh, to, to learn this before everyone. I, I truly believe like uh, it's the people that are loving that are going to receive the wealth transfer first because they're going to be it's the people who pay attention, like the lobster thing that I learned from you. It's like uh, you don't need much money to invest in this and you're already a billionaire so it's just paying attention those who pay attention and trust with their heart because we don't ex we don't exactly know who lobster is even though like uh, when i ask daddy he, he'll tell me it's the white hats but uh, we don't know exactly who it is so you have to trust your heart trust the people who who have faith and uh, then you get the the immense uh, value and the and the wealth transfer before everyone else and um, sure. i guess the people who come after us are not going to have the same prices. They're not going to have the same blessings as us. So yeah, I can tell that you followed your heart and now, now you're here. Yeah, you know, I just, I just want to know, I always wanted to know the truth. I don't like any, anybody lying to me, like my teachers and uh, social media or, or the mainstream media. I want to know the truth, okay? And so when I started to connect with Tim and he opened up this can of worms called the lobster and then he connected me with Emily and she's like a master at understanding what the lobster is. And she's been through the jungle, so to speak. And she knows, you know, which parts of the jungle to stay away from and which parts of the jungle are good. Right. I realized, okay, somebody's guiding me here. 
I'm not doing this on my own. There's nothing special about me, you know? And then one, one thing leads commander. to another. Then I'm, then I'm talking to Crypto Brownie and I'm talking to all these people. And all of a sudden I got a guy in Gibraltar who's studying the lobster. He says, Mel, in about three, four weeks, I'm going to be able to be one of the coaches. Wonderful. That's exactly what we want. We want coaches, we want leadership to rise up right? So that we can figure this whole maze thing out. You see, they made it complicated for a reason because they don't want you to be rich. They don't. They, they, want, they want me and Salim and, and all these people, everybody, okay, suck and win. It's not going to happen. You know why? Because we said, no more, enough. <laughs> Stop it. Yeah. Okay? And so because of that, Okay, we're rising up as a species. We're rising up as a humanity. So we're going to take it to the next level. Maybe one of us or two of us or three of us are not smart enough to figure out this puzzle on our own. But you put thousands of people and everybody's got a small little piece of the puzzle. You're we so become right. dangerous. And that's you exactly what we are. We are, so right. we are at the danger zone right now. You know the song, right? Mm -hmm. All right. <laughs> We're at the danger zone right now. We are. Men have been attacked by the cabal now. I know how it feels like, how it looks like to, to be really involved in a fight uh, against the cabal. But uh, yeah, I keep faith. Uh, I've had voice to school. I had them trying to mess up with my computer, delete my files like I've seen it live. Uh, the mo uh, once uh, Smarty said, subscribe to Source TV. Five seconds later, my computer was crashing, like in the movies, like bzzz, like error, error, error. Like, uh, and when you see when you see this happen to you live, you're like, holy shit, we're in a war. They don't want us to know the truth. And I was just posting a UFO video, you know, and um, they, I've had uh, threats. Like, uh, but I trust Source, and um, I know that we're gonna we're gonna be uh, we're gonna prevail at the end. And um, and um, I'm glad to have other warriors. Um, with us in the group because uh, it's a fight and uh, the cabal is already so organized. They use uh, time travel. They know what's going on in the future. And here we hear human fighting against each other like uh, for, for some ego bullshit and uh, not collaborating. I'm like, what, do, what, what are you guys doing? Like uh, we, we're, we're fighting. <laughs> and some people, sometimes we, you take hits from your own, own team. I'm like, holy shit. But yeah, I'm, um, I'm, for me, I just want to move things forward. I'm, I'm already rich. I'm already rich in frequencies. I'm already, I already have XRP. I already have uh, the lobster accounts. Like uh, now for me, the next frontier is the superpowers and disclosure to know exactly what's going on in space, exactly what's going on in the inner earth, uh, the technology we have exactly what we can do as humans. For me, it is the next frontier. And when you start seeing this, you cannot go back. Uh, you cannot go backwards. And um, so, yeah, I'm, I'm trying to make this transition as, as easy as possible for the people because there is a lot to catch up on because everything was a lie. Like A to Z was a lie. We have to relearn everything, reprogram. And uh, then we start to, to have these capabilities. For now, I see a lot of people who have these uh, limiting beliefs, limiting beliefs and triggers. Like they, um, they, they just uh, get buttered so easily to, to say it simply. They get buttered so easily. They don't, uh, they don't want to learn, but uh, all the truth is out there. Like uh, we have uh, the, dis the best disclosure videos on Source TV. I'm, I'm, I can say it very confidently. We have the free healing frequencies to heal every disease. What the hell do you want? We have healing, we have frequencies to grow food extremely fast in the snow, in the dark. We can grow food in the dark, in the snow. Uh, we, have, uh, we have all the knowledge in the world in YouTube. Like uh, we have the best teachers teaching for free. Like what the fuck, what the hell do you want after that? Like we have Mel posting his videos for free. Uh, you can get it to Lobster. Like uh, you can buy a, kind of a few assets and get billions of tokens we are living in the greatest uh, time to be alive so when i see people that are still moaning bitching whining this guy like uh, pissed me off so much because i'm so excited <laughs> and i'm looking for the people that, that have this excitement because i'm going to the stars i've already seen my ship already seen my ship uh, i know we're gonna where i'm gonna go you know i always say we're gonna we're gonna go right from lamborghinis we're gonna skip flying cars we're gonna go right to flying saucers it's coming Straight up. it's coming Straight up. Yeah. And then levitation. We had a few testimonials about levitation in our groups. Some people did yeah. it. People are saying, what are you talking about? See, like two years ago, three years ago, I said, man, I can't wait to get my XRP. It's $100,000 each. And I'm going to get my <laughs> Ferrari, my Lamborghini, you know, all that shit. I was envisioning like a garage. Now I'm envisioning a garage full of flying saucers. Yes. You know what I mean? Man. 
there's so many UFO videos in the, in the internet. It's now, like, like I'm, I'm, there's so many people in Miami that have a Lamborghini. I'm tired of watching Lamborghinis. I'm, I'm serious. Lamborghini is like caveman technology and, and, and practical and uh, just, uh, yeah, it's, it's just, it's, I'd rather, I'd rather have a, like a economic car that's smaller, that don't attract problems, that don't attract attention. Exactly. And have a spaceship <laughs> that flies to other planets and inner Earth. So yeah, yeah I'm well, super excited about what's coming. Um, um, I want to plug my documentary, The Liberation of Earth. If you guys haven't seen it, like uh, if you want to catch up quickly on what's hap- what I've been doing, uh, going on with the galactics, the White Hats and the Sananda Galactic, aka Jesus, like uh, it's all in one documentary and uh, it's called The Liberation on, of Earth on Source TV. Oh, good, good. Send me the link to that. You have a link to that? So this way we can put it down in the description below. Of course, yes, sir, I'll send it. So yeah, I wanted Absolutely. to plug that because it's uh, it makes people catch up really fast on what has been doing, and it's uh, I'm I'm kind of a blitzkrieg kind of guy. Like I've been researching for decades, and uh, I haven't talked. I was very silent, but uh, now I just put everything in one documentary so people can catch up super fast. I have a video editing background. I, I make videos since 20 years, and yeah. I, I sell videos here in Morocco, etc. So I put all that to use for source source directives and the the angelic tribe, etc. Sananda Galactic. For, yeah. because for me it's the highest cause like uh, you cannot go higher than that there's sure. only source that can hire me that have enough resources to hire me <laughs> right right well i'll tell you what you know uh thanks to the all the all the naysayers out there and all the people that are spreading all this bs about me uh our channel was like nineteen thousand and change like a couple of days ago we just hit we just went over twenty thousand people and we're we're shooting like a star we're headed right for twenty one thousand. okay and uh, you know <laughs> <laughs> I don't know Man. what these, I have no idea what these guys are saying out there. Obviously they're sp- spreading a lot of FUD, but there's some intelligent life on this planet that says, you know what? Let me go check out this guy, Mel. <laughs> and then when Man, they check me out, they say, I think up. I you're like this guy. Videos. Yes. Man, I'm telling what's working for you. It's like, a, it's not the XRP thing. It's not the, the crypto thing. It's your optimism. You're broadcasting optimism frequencies like a, you have that certainty in your heart and people gravitate towards that and you have the, the balls to stand for what you believe. And uh, this is what people respect. And I've seen it uh, in, there is a few people that I respect like that, like Smarty, uh, massive balls for, for what he's doing. Like uh, a few people like that. Um, and then you recently, honestly, it's, uh, we had to manifest you because uh, I was getting so depressed watching the other tutors. Mike Jaco, sorry, we shit talked him. Gene Decode, sorry, we shit talked him. We want, 107, sorry, we should talk to you. <laughs> Mel, I have nothing to say against you. I love it. I just yeah. love it. I'm super grateful for the knowledge. And thank you for not denying source. No, I don't look up. at source. I don't look at source as a guy that died on a cross for all of our sins and all of that. It's a nice story. It's a nice story. But to me, I'm sorry. Uh, and I could be wrong. And I could be maybe headed to hell for what I'm saying right now. But I don't think I am. OK, I think I think that the story is convoluted because they had to sell it to humanity. And because most of humanity are a bunch of chicken brains, they had to formulate a sales pitch that makes sense that you guys would buy. Right. It's a control mechanism. Yeah. You have to deprogram for all this. It's a different story. As yeah. Marty explained. It's a force. It wasn't- it's not a guy that died on a cross. It's a force. It's yes. a power. It's an energy. But yeah, but Jesus was real and it was smarty, Sananda Galactic. And it wasn't 2000 years ago. It was 19,000 years ago. He explained, uh, or 17, like uh, he explained it wasn't a cross. It was a tree. And he was saved at the end, saved by the angelics. And he went okay. to France and he had children. So yeah, if you want to learn the real history, I've been documenting this because uh, he was censored. I have to say this, guys. Uh, smarty was censored so many times. He, they censored his um, Twitter, his uh, old YouTube, his Facebook uh, before that, he was on a website called The Real Truth Calls that was very impractical to, to find the information. So I've been trying to get this out in one channel, uh, Source TV, because uh, people need to know the real history. And when we know this, you're so empowered. You're so empowered when you know that uh, people like this are working to liberate the earth. It's so, it's so empowering because uh, we needed a, a higher help to get, us, to get us rid of these reptilians, dumbs, like... Uh, we're going against them. But is it possible muscles? that that this guy that you said he died on a tree? See, some people think he died on a cross. He says he died on a tree. 
Somebody else is going to say he died in a car accident. You know what I mean? Everybody's got a different belief system. It doesn't system. matter. I have to say it really doesn't matter, uh, Mel, for what we're doing right now. Like, uh, uh, right now, is he healing people, the, the world with his frequencies? Yes. Uh, is he funny? Yes. Is he truthful? Yes. And uh, people will, will take uh, things uh, at their pace. I know this is a lot to take in. Even myself, I've been through a lot of shit before, before uh, ending with Smarty, but I'm, I'm literally trying all the spiritual teachers and I'm, I'm, I'm selecting the best of the best because I want the best for myself. And I want the best for my community because I'm a teacher myself. I want to, I'm documenting this so I can share it with my people, you know, and everyone in the world who, who wants to watch. Okay. For free. But, you know, so, yeah, so it's not like you have to have a, but it's not like you have to have a certain set of beliefs in order to make it to heaven. Let's say there's, there's a heaven and there's a hell. There's a, according to the Catholics, there's purgatory as well, which is like a, hold, a holding cell. <laughs> well, I have no idea what that is. But anyway, I, I think the Catholic religion is one of the funniest religions out there. But anyway, needless to say, what I'm saying is it's not like you have to have a certain set of beliefs to make it to, you know, whatever. I, I don't like, you know, Smarty said, we're going to be able to live forever. And I believe that that is true. I believe that that yes. is coming. OK, it can is. you expire if you want to expire 500 years, a thousand years? from now? Yes, you can. OK, I'm sure you have that free will. But what I'm saying, it's not like you have to, if you're a good person, you want to see humanity survive. And you might not believe in the right exact thing because nobody knows what that exact thing is anyway. Right? Mm. You're still going to yeah, make man, it to wherever you want to go. I, I don't think there is a paradise in hell, but uh, like, like people uh, believe it, like uh, if you do a lot of sins, you're going to hell like, where you get tortured. There's a lot right. of, I come from a Muslim country. I have a Muslim background. I used to go to the mosque and stuff, and we have the same kind of shit. And they also talk about Isa, uh, Jesus, that will come back at the end of times, which is today. And uh, yeah, a lot of it is bullshit just to keep you under control. So I'm deprogramming. And uh, Smarty already explained wh what uh, they mean by hell, what they mean by, by like uh, heaven. We can get into heaven right now. I'm telling to people, don't, don't wait to, till you die to go to heaven. Get to heaven right now. Like get into a higher state of consciousness, get into love and bliss all the time. And you're going to start manifesting like as within, so without. It's very easy now for myself to talk about this because uh, I manifest so fast. <laughs> like I see things happen, like I just visualize it, plan it. Like, okay, this is how it, I want it to be done, 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 boom. And I see it happen. Like uh, you see it uh, happen inside and uh, as without, it becomes uh, outside. Like uh, our master manifestors in the Smartest group, he's been teaching us this. So yeah, I say to people, don't wait to die to go to heaven. Get it, uh, get, get on it now. Like, um, uh, uh, get on the frequencies like the we are so wealthy even someone with zero dollar today with the frequencies is extremely wealthy this is what i'm saying yeah absolutely absolutely and, and you know it, it's it's all about your intention it's all about what do you what is your purpose what do you want to do are you here are you going to be an asset or are you going to be a liability man i have the same mindset it's the military mindset are you a threat, uh, an asset, or a liability? There's only three categories. Right. <laughs> okay. So that's where my mind is at. And if you're an asset and your heart's in the right place and you're doing it for all the right reasons, you're going to be okay regardless of your religion. And I've been protected by so many things. I feel like I have the, I feel the angels all the time. I, have, I know that I have an army of angels working for me. I send them on missions and stuff. And uh, yeah, uh, nothing bad happened to me. Like uh, I, I can comment things. Now I can even comment the weather. Like I say, uh, not not too much sun, please. Uh, cover the sun now. I'm really hot. Like uh, uh, give my parents a good weather when they go on a trip. We're so fucking powerful. When you realize this, like uh, like Smarty said, don't get fooled by this meat suit. We're much more than this. Once you realize that that uh, that you can. Be I need some of those powers, bro. Can I get some of those powers? I I like man, what you're saying. I, you know, man, get on it. It's free. Like uh, I. I'm so grateful because it's free. Like I have, a, when you're in Morocco, Africa, it's so hard to, to buy things in, on the internet. Like a, when I see people just talk about products, like it's nothing to buy them. I, I used all the holos for the abilities, for the third eye, etc. So yeah, at first you have to detox. It's a mindset to remove all the limiting beliefs, but this is gradually, just by watching the good, the, the, the good content. Watch my blog. Like I'm telling you guys, I have the best blog on fucking Telegram. Watch Mukas on Telegram. And uh, you're gonna start uplift, uplifting yourself. Watch the best. Stop, stop listening to dark music, like music with bad vibes. Only put 
a good vibe there like there is not one centimeter in my apartment that doesn't inspire me like uh, there is art everywhere like uh, colors and stuff there is one like there's not one thing in my life that i, that I don't like like uh, everything is in place and uh, you add to the frequencies to that and you remove the programming and you remove the bad people like uh, you have to cut yourself from a lot of bullshit but once you do that uh, man this starts coming online and i cannot wait to leave it at. i told you i'm already uh, i'm on it i already have like have like a, I can tell you paranormal story after paranormal for me, for now it's normal for me, you know? Well, like, we're uh, going to save that for another podcast. Let's talk a little bit about Jasara and Asara, your yes. thoughts about the quantum financial system, your thoughts about lobster. Uh, we always put out the disclaimer that 90 to 95% of all the assets on lobster. Yeah. They're scams. <laughs> we, we don't hide that fact. We say, Hey, here are the teachers, follow them, do what they do. And if they come out with, you know, the other side without blowing up, chances are you're not going to blow up, period, right? Man, I felt very early on about this Nessara thing, like uh, that this was real. And uh, that, that and I, now I noticed that uh, first, I'm so grateful that you that you report on this. Like uh, we have not many places that report seriously on this, that bring all the guests. And before, like a few years back, it was very hard, like... Uh, to, to, to see it for real because there was only like one, two, three people talking about it, very hard to find. Now there are so many, like uh, everyone is talking and the, I see the validations happen like uh, day after day, like the people, the mortgages uh, canceled, like the, the, the Russia going to gold, lobster opening, uh, XRP, uh, you, you notice that XRP is uh, intergalactic technology, like all this makes sense. And I say this to people all, all the time that everything is connected. And um, yeah, if you, if you, connect the dots, it's now for me very clear that this Nesara Jasara is real. It's just gonna be happening in wave. Like it's gonna, it's not, uh, it cannot just hit the world uh, like that. It's, uh, it has to come by stages. Even myself, like I've learned so much, like uh, evolved in consciousness so much in these two years uh, before the, the coronavirus, like learning about the child, child track. I didn't knew this. I, for me, it yeah, was yeah, like- Be careful bankers. with that word. Be careful with that I'm word. I'm sorry. Yes, yeah, you're it's right. fine. Yeah, I, I, I only knew like the lower levels of the, the bad people. And when you start to know that uh, they, they, they are these dumps, there are the, the, the stuff in the in space, like it's it, you realize that it's just much, much bigger than what we initially yeah. thought. And you start expanding your consciousness. And for me, it's just the first step Nesara Jesara for, for us to to like to like get ready to get in the, to become intergalactic. Like uh, it's going to be like uh, for us to be like kindergarten. We get out of kindergarten. Now we are adults or so like a uh, teenagers adults we can start going to the stars for me it's like the, yeah. the first step but the problem is me and you're already in fourth and fifth grade and these guys are still in pre-k yeah. that's the problem <laughs> we're waiting for all the pre-k's to graduate and get up to our so we're just sitting pa- impatiently waiting because you know as we've been waiting for a long time you know something you said man so important something you said in one of videos is the hundred month effect is that the more people are aware of this the faster it's going to manifest and uh, we see it happen like uh, each time um, smarty like uh, do commands or report on the on the on the Nisara Jesara, we see validations happen like uh, quickly after like people tell me in the comments uh, i'm receiving money i don't know what i don't know from where um just just looking at what happened with lobster for me it's like uh, one of your guests said it's miraculous the fact that you can buy the cabal assets for pennies holy holy when, when i'm on lobster i'm like holy shit and it's so simple so fast for me, a Moroccan, where it's so hard to to do international business, usually with the Swift. Swift is, uh, is I, I, like yeah. I want them down because they, 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 like if we're less than for, for uh, us in Africa, we're less than for these guys. So I'm super happy. This is why I was excited about XRP. Initially, for me, XRP was just a way to uh, exchange uh, money internationally. But it's just a big problem for me. Like I have to use PayPal, and uh, sometimes my bank accepts, sometimes it doesn't accept. You can get money out. Uh, you, you can you cannot get money out uh, under a stretch. Like it's so complicated. So for me, so, simplifying all this and being all one, like uh, on the same level in Africa or in America or in Europe, and for me, it's a it's a beautiful project, and uh, I'm motivated myself. So so I can start buying stuff like like no, like a normal guy on the internet. Yeah. Absolutely. For me, lobster is a big step. And I noticed that you can even transfer funds. For example, if I want to pay someone, if I want to pay smart, for example, I, I love Smarty. I can't even buy on his website because I cannot uh, log into Cash App or Revolut. This way, this website don't accept Moroccans straight up. They tell you you're Moroccan, fuck out of here. <laughs> so in lobster, you can get your assets in. 
Mm -hmm. I can uh, I can change my XRP into XLM, put it into Lobster, and pay Smarty that way. It's so much simpler, so much simpler than uh, than having to go through a bank. That's like a now yeah. I, I, I have to drag me to my bank to go there. Like when I have to go there, I'm like oh shit. So yeah, I'm uh, I'm so happy this uh, new system is rolling out and uh, it's happening in front of our, of our eyes. Like uh, if you don't see what's happening, like uh, we heard uh, like uh, a cabal arrested, like uh, the White House closing. FBI closing, Buckingham Pass closing, like all this couldn't happen in one day. Like the uh, Federal Reserve, the IRS, uh, the, exactly. the, the the Treasury people being arrested, all of it. And, and we got we got this. You know what I mean? And uh, and you know, and the seventeenth letter and the alphabet, all part of Jasara and Asara. Trump is connected to Space Force. Space Force connected to the Galactic Federation. The Galactic Federation connected to. And it just goes on and on and on and on. And people are sitting here saying, you guys are crazy. Really? <laughs> no, it's, it, they're starting to get it slowly. When you when you see the visuals, when you see the videos of the UFOs, when you see the videos of the ETs, uh, we have so much footage now, like it's very hard to deny what's happening. So yeah. uh, right. I, I think they're doing a gradual disclosure because uh, what has been happening was so intense, so hardcore. Then uh, if they release it all, even myself, I, I don't know if you... If you said there was a video, if you know what frazzle, frazzle D means, like uh, if you've seen that, like you cannot uh, imagine this uh, times a million with the times, I don't know how many millions of kids underground and the people discovering this and piles of body, etc. So they're doing a gradual disclosure. And what I've noticed is it's happening like in the movies, in the video games, in the, yeah. in the truthers that are, that are coming out and that are not uh, being, being uh, stopped right away. Like, I don't know if you noticed in the movies, like I know that uh, Hollywood has been taken over. Like, uh, it's not the old, the old Hollywood that we used to have. Like, uh, I don't know if you noticed, like uh, at maybe 2000, 2015, 2014, like there was a switch in Hollywood where it wasn't uh, an agenda based before there was already, they were always trying to, to say like uh, Russians bad, uh, Taliban's bad, Arab bad, like uh, CIA is good. They're trying to stop the terrorists. But at, in 2015, there was a switch where they're starting doing all this closure that they, they did Operation Paperclip. They talked about yeah. it in uh, Captain America. They talked about uh, the secret space program, uh, Jupiter ascending, like the gray abductions in the Jupiter ascending. Like, uh, and, and it's been nonstop disclosure, like uh, transdimensional travel yeah. uh, entities. Now it's in the movies nonstop. And people think it's a uh, fiction, but actually yeah. it's real. And I think it's raising the consciousness of people that, so they start to understand that uh, all this is going to be real. And at some point, they're going to say, oh, by the way, all this was real and people are not going to be as shocked, right. I think. Salim, I'm going to tell you a joke. And I don't know, yes. maybe because of your uh, Moroccan heritage and, and uh, culture, you might or might not get it. So I'm going to say it anyway. You know, they say there's only seven bad people in the world. They just travel a lot. <laughs> okay. <Man. laughs> I get it. Like this, we are so much more powerful than so much more... Uh, like yes, yeah. so much more. Like, um, yeah, I know the victory is assured. For now, for now, I'm just having fun cracking jokes with Smarty yeah. and uh, posting disclosure videos. I know we won a long time ago. Yeah, yeah. This is why I'm so, so happy and so excited, brother. I, I'm so happy that you're going to be working with us uh, in a, in an administrative uh, capacity. I'm I'm so glad that we hooked up. We're going to definitely do some more uh, podcasts together. Maybe we'll do maybe me one with you and. Uh, uh, you know, um, King Smarty at the same time. What do you think about that? That would be nice. And your house, your rules, as you like. I love it. Yeah. You know, so I'm, ha I'm just having fun. You know, a lot of people say, you know, uh, you know, Mel, I had people call me and say, Mel, you used to suck, <laughs> you know? And I did. I was horrible. I was a train wreck waiting wait to happen. But I'm getting better. I'm having fun with it, you know, and it goes wherever it wants it to go. You know, the energy of the universe man, is charge. I'm just going along for the ride. You got to be forgiving with yourself, Ben. You're, uh, you've been, uh, I know that uh, the people like us have been targeted, even myself from a very young age. Now our, the post uh, um, afterwards, I realized that I've been targeted. Like uh, there was really some people that entered my life just to make me miserable because I, they knew I was going to be shining at some point. Like, uh, and uh, we've been taking so much poison, crap, like I've eaten so much poison, so much, uh, like uh, all kinds of poisoning, programming, EMFs, and uh, you have to be forgiving with yourself because we're we're into a real war and they're attacking us hard. Oh man! It doesn't look like it, um, yeah. like that, you know. 
See, I've been I've been on to them for 30 years. And so immediately I started to do things to reverse what they were doing to me. But I have to know, yeah, I need I need to know what you're doing to me before it's like, okay, you got uh, Colgate toothpaste and it's got this poison, that poison, this poison. Okay, I stopped using Colgate toothpaste. I'm gonna use a toothpaste that maybe costs a little more, but it doesn't have any poisons in it, right? So you have to know how to defend yourself. If you don't know what they're doing to you, how in the world are you going to know how to defend yourself, right? Some people don't even realize what's happening to them, and they're so poisoned. And like this, I have family members that are so sick that took the thing. Yeah, uh, of course. They have uh, fertility issues. They have to go to the doctor, pay thousands of dollars in, in chirurgical uh, things when they could have used the holograms for free and fix this in a and few days. And you probably you know? told them about not, do, not to do it, right? I told them, but like uh, some people just don't listen and they get to, they're so programmed. Like it's like, like you're talking to a wall. But you yeah, of course I tried. You can't fix stupid, not even with duct tape. We're, start, we're starting to do it. There's a stupid hologram. <laughs> <laughs> Anti-stupid hologram, and we have testimonials for it, man. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. That's funny, bro. Hey, man, it was a pleasure speaking with you. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and promote you to administrator immediately. I'm going to promote Thank you also you. in the 3.0 room. So if you have anything of importance to post, like news or whatever regarding XRP or the quantum financial system or Jasara and Asara, you always post it in the 3.0 room, and it will automatically uh, post in the main room. We originally had mm -hmm. launched the main room, and, and then I said, you know what, because I, I'm also a member of Whiplash, I said it would make sense to have a room that, that functions sort of like Whiplash's room, right? So what I did, I opened up, this is a year and months ago, I opened up the 3.0 room thinking that we're going to migrate over everybody from the main room over to the room that is exact carbon copy uh, of the way it functioned from a functionality standpoint, just like Whiplash and try to migrate everybody over and shut down the main room, right? Nobody wants to migrate over. They like controlled chaos. Don't ask me why, you know? Because this room, I had to actually slow it down where people can post something. Like if you post something back to back and you're not an administrator, you have to wait like a minute before you can post your next thing because it was going so fast that people couldn't keep up with it. You know what I mean? Mm. So, so uh, is so epic. I'm learning every day. Like we have so much functionalities and you have the ability to be organized like to have links uh, to other groups. And so we have different pages. We have uh, the library, we have the hospital, we have a military section. We yeah. have like, a, we're really organizing SD. Yeah. Gonna, and, I'm going to transfer this to you. And I got yes, my, I got it. my hologram for my, my sinus. You, you got know, it, bro. Yeah. And I recommend you to, to the, the print the sheets. The hologram sheets are really strong. Like detox. I, I, yeah. I printed it and I put it on, I put it on, um, what do you call it? Uh, laminated. I put it on. Yeah, The sheet is like several holograms in one page. Yeah. 40 holograms in one page broadcasting oh, really? like uh, uh i don't know how many feet but uh, bro broadcasting 50 feet so it's easier to have like a one sheet with 50 holograms instead of having a one hologram per page if you see what i mean so okay I'm so i i could i could put 50 holograms on one page yes this is what and i'm doing like uh, because there's 800 holograms are you going to print them all uh, page by page this is why I, I, I put on I put in the sheets so people can have a, several holograms printed at once, like all the holograms for weight loss. There is a whole you meant, there is holograms from libido that are so strong. There is holograms for love and relationship. I recently connected with my twin, thanks to the I think it's for with the holograms, telepathic communications. Man, at some point we're gonna start tele, just telepathically uh, in contact. Uh, there is a, a hologram sheets just to, to grow food. If you have a garden or if you have a, yeah if you want to grow trees print this shit and put it to like in your garden next to the water and that's it i'm trying to make it really simple because people are suffering like uh, like smarty said and it's been very hard for me at the beginning because uh, it wasn't that easy like to figure shit out uh, it was censored all the information was scattered around now i put everything in one place with one link so people can get it quickly and um, so yeah so can we can save the world faster and people can stop uh, well people are just so starting to get around to the stuff see i've been i've been um you know, uh, uh, I, I understood the Tesla technology 25 years ago, okay? Uh, and so this is based on Tesla technology. People don't understand that uh, because, you know, what was, what was Tesla doing? He was tapping into the fabric, uh, thin air, and creating electricity out of thin air. So why is this impossible? So I don't know. Maybe it's me. Maybe I'm reading too much into it, Salim. But I put the bottle of water on there yesterday, and even though my water is filtered, it tasted a little bit different. It tastes different, man. The water is so, it's so delicious. Man, uh, 
I, I can do the difference like a water distilled charge before charge and after charge the, the taste is clearly different so yeah i'm addicted to water now drinking all the time yeah i drink water and hibiscus tea a lot you know i mean i'll drink a cold beer if it gets really really hot I like a beer that's like 34 degrees temperature really ice cold you know um <laughs> but that's like i don't i don't really i don't really indulge in alcohol at all but uh brother it was an absolute absolute pleasure speaking with you uh, let's work together, brother, because together we can Same. make some serious shit happen. You know what I mean? Yes, sir. Yes. We'll I talk soon, you. my brother. Thank you so Thank much you for your Mel time. Thank you, so much. Bye-bye. Love you guys. Bye-bye.